Hi, this is Steve with Barefoot Bricks, coming to you with another video. I got this other Lego collection that included this small classic pirate set, number 6258, The Smuggler's Shanty, released in 1992. It contained three minifigures, a shark, a boat, and this little shanty that the pirates were using to smuggle their gold through the Caribbean. This is a great set. It has a lot of playability. And I bet kids really loved it in 1992. Now this is what I got in the collection. And sadly, it was missing a few things. It was missing the shark. It was missing the boat. It was missing the Imperial Army flag. It was missing that classic 1980s and 90s gold but for being 30 years old these mini figures look fantastic there is almost zero signs of wear we've got these one by one by six black pillars that hold up these palm leaves to provide a little shade for the pirates or a hiding place for this gold on this tiny little island Again, this looks really good. I'm sure kids had a ton of fun with it. Got this Imperial Army officer with his classic musket. Again, he looks really good. His legs work, his arms work. Almost zero sign of wear. It is a great set and a great piece of history to have. Now, I wanted to try my hand at recreating this but unlike my last video I wasn't gonna limit myself to the same size base plate I wanted to try something completely different so I moved all of this out of the way dumped all the sand and tan base plates I had out and I got to work building an island Took me a couple of tries to get the right shape because I wanted to have a shape that looked very tropical, an island that looked tropical, something that the pirates could use to hide the gold on because I didn't like the way the gold was out in the open in the original mock. Here was my overall island. I think it looks fantastic. Very tropical looking, this big palm tree, this little rock formation, the two pirates sitting under the palm leaves. It looks great. Here's the backside. It doesn't have any water, and I'll show you why in just a second. I added this play feature to hide the gold inside this rock formation. Pretty simple technique used, but I think it looks really well it's hard to notice that there might be gold hidden in there this palm tree is connected by a technic pin and a sideways building technique for a one by two technic stud here's the overall mock it's on a 32 by 32 base plate a sideways building technique for the water again i did not have the right imperial flag but we've got the Imperial Army officer rowing the boat through the water. And he is going to get the jump on these pirates who are asleep under the palm tree. Because they have drank too much rum. Yeah. Again, here's the overall creation. I think this looks really good. Pretty simple water build. But I wanted to stay true to the simplicity of the original set. The island looks good. The water has a little bit of color around the boat. A little bit of color for the depth in the dark blue. Again, here's the build. 6258, the smuggler shanty. I think I did a pretty good job staying true to the simplicity of this build and if lego built 
dioramas for all of their classic themes. I know I certainly would be purchasing them. But what do you think? Do you think this is a good reproduction? Did I stay true to the original set? What would you change? Would there be something else you would add? Let me know in a comment below. Again, my name is Steve with Barefoot Bricks. If you enjoy this content at all, please hit the like button, subscribe, leave a comment. It really does help. Share this with a friend. I appreciate all the recognition as I'm trying to grow this channel. And I hope you enjoy your building and keep your bare feet off of bricks.